And welcome back, outcasts, to another episode of The Squib. So our objective is to get into the College of Winterhold. But, uh, Ferelda over on the bridge there requires us to cast a spell, which we can't do. So, um, we could, our option is to get our uh, Persuade skill way, way up. And that would take a long time, so we're gonna try the back, the back way. Uh, not sure how successful we're actually gonna be at. Um, not sure how successful we're actually going to be at getting through the midden, but we'll see. Let's give it a shot. What was that? Hmm. Uh, oh boy. Let's try not to die on our way down here. Okay, there we go. Should be able to get up there. The question is, are we going to be able to sneak through the midden without getting killed by all the all the nasty things in there oh yeah before we actually go in there uh, let's see where we're at right now so we're at level three got uh, one point each uh, one stat each into health and stamina I put a point into enchanting because I want to get uh, scroll crafting novice so I can start making novice level scrolls and uh, Alchemy is at 29. I put one point in there. And that's it. Uh, speech is slowly going... Actually, speech is going up fairly fast since we have the Thief Stone activated. As you can see, we're almost at uh, level 3. Just uh, literally crafting one or two more potions. And we would be good to go. Can I get up there? Come on. You can do it. Up, 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 up. There. Okay, here we are. Now, this is the tricky part. Might want to do it in first person. Come on. Up, 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 up. Get up there. It's a bit of a gamey way of doing it, but... Come on. Oh, oh! Almost there. Come on. You can do it. There we go. Okay, and I think I'll save here, just in case heading through the midden doesn't work out so well for us. Yeah, we got spiders to deal with. Um, oh, you know what? Might be able to is it possible to bypass some of them? Um, maybe on this side? Come on, get up there. Oops. Now, that rock pushes me off. Oh, there we go. Um, hmm. Oh, 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 I almost got up there. Oh, and I did. Nice. Come on. Up, 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 up. Jump. There we go. Now, which way am I going? Um, that's outside. That's where I came from. That's probably the way I want to go.
Aha! To the midden. Can't remember if the can't quite remember if midden uh oh. Nope. Oh, I'll take that. Don't worry about me. Can't remember if the Atronach Forge is in the midden or the midden dark. Other strips, don't need that. He's over there, but I don't think he's actually trying to find us. Ah. Take these things, absolutely. Sneak increased. Okay, that's not locked. Might as well level up. Um, yes, 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 yes. Definitely scroll crafting. Torch bugs. And there is the forge. Huh, what's that? Atronach Forge Manual. Nephew, I apologize. Oh, wait, how long is this? Oh, not too long. Okay, we'll read the. Nephew, I apologize that I cannot see you personally before you leave. The trip from Sadrath Mora is treacherous this season, where I would have visited upon hearing the news. The Nords have a fine college at Winterhold, and I am sure you will excel. You may know that I, too, attended there. I was quite the conjuration adept in my own day. I am sending you my notes on some co something called the Atronach Forge, a bit of a project of mine while at Winterhold. Mention nothing to the faculty, but ask your fellow pupils about a place called the Midden. You'll find the forge there. I fear a number of my notes are missing, scattered and lost in my travels around Skyrim. Perhaps you may stumble across these in your own adventures. The Atronach Forge offers few clues as to who built it, and even fewer as to how to unlock its full potential. Only through blind experimentation and a few singed eyebrows have I been able to understand its function. The forge is mostly a large dais, almost crude of make, but emblazoned with the traditional Diedrich rune. A offering box is attached, as well as a prominent lever. The dais also features a large setting which seems to seems set to receive some large spherical object. I've had no luck determining what this missing object may be, however, or what effect it may have on the eff efficacy of the forge. The forge is activated by placing certain items into the offering box and then pulling the lever. The forge consumes the items and conjures something upon the dais. The conjuration can be, a predic can be predicted reliably if the appropriate items are left in the box, but Many combinations either have no effect or catastro catastrophic reactions. Once I conjured a wild goat. Well, most of the goat, at least. Experimenting wildly with the forge is dangerous. I have, re I have recorded such recipes as I have discovered on the following pages. The simplest, yet perhaps most hazardous, sample staple stable recipe is that for a summoned Atronach. The conjured brutes will attack the first thing they see, however. Be ready for battle if you have reason to use these recipes. Flame Atronach, Frost Atronach, Storm Atronach. Okay, so that's all he's got. So Fire Salts, Ruby, Fire Salts, Sapphire, I mean Frost Salts, Sapphire, 
And void salts and amethysts. I'll take that. Necromancer's Moon. The Necromancer's Moon. A note. A forewarning to the Order of the Bookworm. <laughs> Sorry, Black Worm. <laughs> Fire Salts. I'll take those. Ruby. A broom. Wardrobe. It's got a hat in it. Oh. Okay. Now, I'm going to use some foreknowledge that I need a soul gem and something else. Yeah. Soul gem and an, a uh, piece of ore or ingot to create the um, Atronach conjuring tools that I want. What is this? Activate altar. Well, looks like there's like water running above me. <coughs> Pardon me. What does this do? The ritual must be performed after midnight. Sorry. In the light of the revenant. What ritual? Okay. Well, never mind that. Just will grab these torch bug thoraxes. Uh oh. No, 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 no. Uh, how am I going to get past that thing? My sneak is just not good enough. Might have to just kind of make a run for it. Maybe. Maybe that'll work. Is it like right there? Yes. Don't come in here. So I can't get out. Oh boy. Um. Oh, to hell with it. Let's just make a run for it. Okay. Well, we made it to there. I don't know if it plans on uh, following me. More brooms. I know that I'm going to need the brooms. This leads to Skyrim, does it? Hmm. College of Winterhold. Excellent. Aha. Okay then. Now. I did do that, so... Let's just head over here. Oh, storm. Inscription Dungeon and Midden. Alright, now we're talking. 
So we've got soul gems, greater. Ooh, a greater soul gem. I can probably, I think I can use that for Natronac. Um, an Atronach staff. Ruined books. Guide to scroll crafting. This is your guide to scroll crafting. Learning all the most powerful spells is quite difficult and time consuming. With scroll crafting, you'll be able to perform all arts of magic through basic ingredients you'll find throughout your journey. In order to craft any type of scroll, you're going to need to use the inscription table and have an inkwell and a quill. Don't worry, as long as you have these items on you, you'll be able to craft scrolls. You'll never use your quill or inkwell when crafting a scroll. Not having these items in your inventory will cause the inscription table to be blank with no, no craftable scrolls. Each scroll will also require a minimum of one paper roll and one charcoal. These items will be used up after each scroll you craft, or for each one. You can also put all those ruined books laying around throughout Skyrim to use. By having at least two ruined books, you're able to craft them into five rolls of paper. There's a few items within the inscription dungeon to help you get started and craft a couple scrolls. Now that you've learned the basics, get out there and perform some magic without the need of all the magic training. Take that. There's an inkwell and a quill. Some paper. There's nothing there. There's a bed here that I can sleep on. It's nice. It's this. Soul gem fragments, no. Actually, what's Debella's uh, thing do for me? Speechcraft. Okay, let's see. So, roll of paper. Um, ruined books. Is that the only way to make papers from ruined books? Okay, so I can create a scroll of candlelight. Conjure familiar, courage, fury, ghost. Appear as a ghost for 30 seconds. Improves night vision for 30 seconds. Raise zombie. Need some bone meal. Charcoal. How do I make charcoal? Firewood. Firewood and a torch. Need ectoplasm for that. Troll fat. A bee. I think I used I collected bees earlier, but used them, right? Um, and a petty soul gem. Lesser soul gem. Charcoal. I could create craft that. Scroll of candlelight. Hmm. So those are the. Is that and how come they should? You'd think there'd be more uh, novice level scrolls than that. Hmm. Don't know. Okay, let's scroll of Ray Zombie. Take those. Sure, glow dust. Some more rolls of paper. Oops. Don't really need the basket. Of course, it landed behind me. There we go. Okay. So that's that. I can make rolls of paper that weigh one pound. They're worth four. Don't actually have everything for this. I still need charcoal, which I need firewood for. I don't think there's any firewood around here. No. Okay. Can't actually get started just yet. Ugh. The weather's terrible.
Okay. Please don't bother the Archmage unless it's absent. So if there are any problems, let me know. It's my job to keep things running smoothly. Yeah. Just having fun? It's always encouraging to see the younger generations embracing education. Absolutely. What do you have for so sale? You to master the arcane arts. Staff of a familiar? Staff of zombies. Can't actually afford either of them. Scroll of, his of hysteria. Creature and creatures and people up to level 12 flee from combat. Oak flesh stone flesh no mage light. Um soul gems. Okay. Um Take care now. Right. I thought the Main quest here was going to start up. What if I talk to Mine you? Is not a no. Position, but someone needs to keep things running smoothly around here. Navern, are you of the sort that believe you're here to change the world, or are you only in it for yourself? Oh, those shadows are terrible. I assure you that I shall be watching all of you very closely. Uh -huh. Like it all. I think I need uh, subtitles. General and dialogue. This college is a direct influence. It is up to each of us to present ourselves publicly okay. as we choose. Okay. So. This should be locked, right? Yeah. So. Can I. F can I fast travel? No, you know what? If I fast travel here, I'm going to end up on the other side of that. So, I need Tolfdeer's quest to start, don't I? I need this to begin, or I'm not. The college will be here for and you it's no not matter. starting. That's not good. Might have broken things. Well, it's not really broken. I just have to go out to, uh, to Ferelda. Which means I'm going to have to... Next time I'm going to be able to come here is... Unless I keep coming through the Midden, which is a pain. Uh... I'm gonna have to level up my my speech skill way way up. I have to get it up either to a hundred or I think it's to seventy with persuasion. Yeah, it makes thirty percent easier. I at least have to get it to seventy so that I can pass her speech speech check and get in. They say knowledge is its own. Legitimately. You, you can see me. Of course, I can see you. I found it all. I was quite sure I was invisible, or at least. Oh my, that's quite a difficult question. Never underestimate the ability to influence others. Whether they're friends or foes, they're almost all susceptible to illusion spells. Mm. They can turn the tide of a battle in a moment's notice. There are also spells that help in avoiding conflict altogether. Invisibility is tricky to master, but exceptionally useful. Whoa, are you okay there? Take a look. What do you have to sell? Staff of Courage. Not really useful. Firestorm, that's nice. Um, Muffle. I wonder if I can create a spell of Muffle. Do I need... I mean, a scroll of Muffle. If I buy this... I think this is like a depth level, though, right? Hmm. 
and buy another one of those. Good day. Okay, let's just see. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be if I fast travel here, I'm gonna be outside. Yep. And then I can't get through because I haven't done the thing with Ferelda. Oh. Well, that's unfor. What's going on over there? Let's not look at that. Okay, so we're gonna have to leave it there and we're gonna have to do a lot more adventuring uh, before we can come back here and actually make use of the college. So anyway, thank you for m very much for watching. We'll see you in the next episode.